Hello everyone and welcome to day 213, I think, 212-213 of uh, Project 365. Um, today is going to be sort of a quick thing. Um, about three or four days ago, uh, a person by the name of Pat Condell put out a video on the Ground Zero Mosque. Yet again, I have to talk about this because I feel it's a necessity. Um, in his video, he went on to say something to the effect of uh, this mosque was some like symbol of victory over 9-11, and that's completely stupid. Um, as I've said numerous times before, this isn't a mosque. It doesn't even resemble a mosque. Mosques are only used as places of prayer, so... Um, the fact that he's actually going on and saying that this uh, community center is a mosque is stupid. And then he goes on to talk about, and then the fact that it's not even at ground zero. I don't know how many times I have to say that, but apparently I have to keep repeating it. Um, but it isn't at ground zero. It's about four to five blocks away from ground zero. And unless you're walking on the street that it's on, you won't see it from ground zero. You know what you will see, though? Two churches. Two. Um, why is it that, because of the work of extremists, the Islam, the Church of Islam is put on this, like, path of hatred and discrimination, and yet, you know, the other two churches are completely okay? Um, I think that's ridiculous, because, first of all, there were Muslims who worked in the building who died, and yet they can't have a even if it were a church, they can't have a church near us the same place. Don't let the stance of extremists take over fundamental rights everyone should have. Just because we hold prejudices due to extremists doesn't mean that we should automatically assume that everyone who believes in said religion is automatically an extremist or who is automatically a terrorist. That's just ignorant. And then to say that this is some symbol, some, like, representation of victory, um, if there were people who are of the Islamic faith who believe that 9-11 was a victory, um, they're stupid. I'm sorry, but that's just dumb. Um, I wouldn't consider it a victory since we lost 3,000 people. They've lost numbers in the tens of thousands of people all because of this war that was started by a couple of extremists who said they were Muslim. Um, and now, really, we have no reason to believe that they were. Um, but you know what? I mean, the fact that we actually have to do this is stupid. The fact that we actually have to discuss this and argue over this, just because we want to impose our own personal morality... Uh, onto something doesn't mean we should. People are saying, oh, just because they could build the community center doesn't mean they should. You know what? No. They should do it. They should do it because they have the right to do it. We, however, do not have the right to impose onto others our will simply because of the fact that we don't agree with their book, that we simply don't agree with their God, or simply because of the fact that we choose to assume that they are like all the other extremists in the world. That is what's really stupid. And so hopefully, hopefully, this doesn't get stopped. Because if it does, then it's the first step towards ending every foundational right we have had when the Constitution was made and what our forefathers set out to create. But, alas, I'm just a kid in college. What else do I know? Uh, question for you guys today. Do you honestly believe that this Ground Zero mosque would be a detriment to New York? Or do you think that maybe, perhaps, a lot of people are having a, too much of a knee-jerk reaction? And that they think that automatically, because it's related to Islam or Muslims, that it's automatically some breeding center for terrorists, when in fact, it's actually used for the whole community. I don't know. Tell me what you guys think below. Um, and yeah, that's it for today, guys. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.